Good luck. Good luck. Referee for this one tonight, Matthew de Gabriel from Malta. Two Thank captains, you. Suleiman. Center back Suleiman Torre remain in the defensive unit, while Martin Adeline is the only survivor in midfield from the 5 0 win. Now, Adeline, strong start as expected by France, seeing plenty of the ball. Here's Bart. Abdul Bart. Well, made the opening, but the, the finish wasn't the best. Despite the fact they scored five goals, some of the finishing did leave a, a bit to be desired against Slovakia. The scoreline could easily have been Adeline. Fancies it, but is off target. So just a couple of long-range efforts so far from France. And there initially by Nicolas Popescu. So many options for the man on the ball. Da Silva wins it back. Chauna, Da Silva. Still Da Silva. Plenty of... A storming run forward and a fine effort by Ducouri straight at the goalkeeper Bonnie on the follow-up and now the whistle's gone was ultimately straight at the goalkeeper but hit with power Bonnie with the uh, the follow-up Jordan Semedo Varela with a lovely ball the left back how neat was the free kick floated in it's a crew almost on the end of it Nice idea. Adeline fizzes it across. Could have gone anywhere that. Did Popper get something on it? A painful one for Pante. It's a lovely ball though to Chauna. Now Adeline dummies it, leaves it for Bonnie who gets the shot away and forces the save. Out of Popper. Lovely swift counter again, though, by France. All born out of the header from De Silva. Neat little dummy by Adeline and just shifted it to the left, Bonnie, to get it. It's played on again. Churuna with the ball back in and the effort from the captain, Torre. Lovely break again from France. They use the wide areas. It's fallen for Chauna. He's off target. Couldn't really get any power into the shot, so went for placement instead. He's trying to bend it. Takes on Pantea. Gets away from him. Fires it across. And Popper did well. And it's another outstanding France heading for the semi finals as it stands. It's Romania nil, France two at half time. Bonnie, touch back to De Silva. It's a good save by Popper. Lovely football by France. An unselfish play from Bonnie as well. Chauna. A corner. Great run by Virginius. But a centre forward that hasn't seen too much of the ball. You would have wondered whether he'd uh, taken a touch and turned and tried to go for goal, but did the right thing, just laid it up for De Silva. Eskew goes for goal and it's just over the top. Hello from Radoslavescu. Cutting in, just checking, a little look up for that far corner. Just ten minutes to go, who knows? It's Romania 1, France 2. Finals. Here's Illy in behind, Illy squares it! And it's 2 2! Oh, the flag has gone up for offside. What a let off that is for France. Table on goal difference going into the final game against Italy for Romania and the host Slovakia. They're going to be left to fight it out for third place in the group and a spot in that FIFA under 20 World Cup playoff. The first half dominated by France, goals from Chauna and Adeline had them two up inside 20 minutes and it looked as though it was going to be another comfortable night as it was against Slovakia but key changes made by Adrian Vasai in the second half, Romania looked better, Kubis bought them some hope eight minutes from time but ultimately it wasn't enough, France and Italy through, it's finished Romania 1, France 2.